Yo, what's going on guys? This is Kagback here with another Discord video. And in today's video guys, I thought I would make an updated video of how you get all of the Discord badges and just essentially all of them. Because it has been quite a while since I made the last one and there is numerous amount of badges as you can see that have been added here. So let's just get right into it. So here are the three Hype Squad badges where you can actually just go into your user settings and then Hype Squad and you can take the test and it will randomly give you a badge determined on your results then we have early supporter here which if you were a subscriber before october 2018 you would have got this badge here and if you were a concurrent nitro subscriber after that you were awarded the the nitro game subscription instead of the nitro classic subscription uh, but it would be at the same price of the classic subscription next one is the discord staff badge and this is only for employees at discord to show that they are actual staff members if somebody has this badge in their status message do not trust them they are not an actual staff member next is the discord partner badge which is awarded to people that are part partnered with Discord and you can actually apply for Discord partner at discordapp.com slash partners I'm pretty sure but at the time of this recording applications are closed but check in in a while and you'll probably be able to apply again. Next is Hype Squad events. This is for people that actually go to events and meet up with Discord at said so event. Applications for this badge are over at discord.com slash hype squad or slash events. I'm not too sure. I'll put the link in the description regardless. Applications are also currently closed for this badge also. And the reason for that is just too much requests. They're going to process them, reopen the forums, and then do the same thing again. Next is the Nitro badge, which obviously uh, I touched on a little bit earlier, is for Nitro subscribers. And it will also display the date you have been subscribed to the service since. Next is the Bug Hunter badge, which is awarded to people that report bugs to Discord. And you will get, and if you report a certain amount of bugs to the Discord staff team, you will be awarded this badge. Now, all of these badges here are Nitro boosting badges. Pretty much if you go and subscribe to the Nitro subscription and not Nitro Classic, you will have a boost to use on a Discord server. And essentially you can level up the server's boosts, and so on and so forth. And you will be given a badge on your profile to show how long you have been boosting for. The triangle one is one month, then it goes to two months, three months, then it goes to six months, nine months, one year, 15 months, 18 months, and then two years. And you have to consistently be boosting that server so you can't just change servers, you change the boost to a different server because that will change the badge also. And yeah guys, that should be it for today's video. If you liked today's video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more, and I will catch you guys in the next one.